everybody? This week in AQ3D, the team released www.aq3d.com. You can visit there to play the new beta test flash version of the game. Note it is still really buggy and you need Flash Player 11.2 for the game to run smoothly and without crashing. You can check out two of the videos I posted. One was the regular version and I was running Flash Player 11.3. And the second one, where I do a little shop update, I was running Flash Player 11.2, and the game ran smoother for me. This week's Adventure Quest Worlds release is live. In Battleon, you can talk to Rorgog to get some epic dual gear from the Infernal Infiltration War that's made its way into Adventure Quest Worlds. Also, the Lore Olympics shop is still open in Battleon for a limited time. Get some member only items, non-member items, and AC items. This week is the finale of the Dage vs. Nulgith War. Whose side will win? Whoever side wins, that developer artist will release their list of items for the winning side. Nulgith has 29 items and Dage has a bunch of items, I don't know the exact number. Also, Dage will soon be releasing his Dark Caster class for those who originally bought the original Dark Caster armor only. Also, the Dage and Nulgith Legion shops have been updated with a few new items. Hey everybody, this week in Epic Duel, there is no release as the final Vault Door is at 27 million health with the Exiles leading with about a 2 million health point lead. The Legions don't rally together. The Exiles will win probably by the end of the weekend, and we might get a release next week with post-war. I don't know, the winning side will probably get an achievement and new items. This week in Hero Smash, the Blockbuster Movie Fest has returned. The Movie Megaplex has got an update with tons of brand new items, some members only, some Smash coins, but the majority of them are for free non-member. Also this week, the battle polls continue as the Nalgith and Dage fight by head to head and Nalgith is in the lead by 10% followed by Dage hey everybody this week in Dragon Fable the Wrath of Wargoth continues you join the war camp the war meter is currently at 62% once we get to 75% which should happen tomorrow we'll get a special guest to get into battle, defeat five waves, and that'll equal a war complete. And turn in a wave so we can get closer to winning the war. Also, Pyromancer is continuing its production in game, and the tests are almost complete, and the class will be coming really soon. Everyone, this week in MechQuest, visit Maguian in the Knife and Spork Diner that is in Solana City West. If you head left until you find the Knife and Spork Diner, talk to a Maguian. Click on Contest. Challenge 6 will be unlocked, and level 33 is recommended for Challenge 6. The release is not yet live, but it will be li live later tonight. That is Friday, August 3rd. Hey everyone, this week in Adventure Quest, Building Trompia Part 2 releases with a brand new cutscene, quests, and items.